Hi, in this video, we'll see how to view your data from your data source itself. Now, for example, I have picked up the same sample superstore file. Okay, there are three sheets which are present orders, people, and you can see as returns. These are three different sheets. If I want to see the data, what I can do is there are various methods. Either I can pick up and drag it and drop it here. Okay, you, say, you can see this order sheet has come and that's the data which is visible. Or if I want, I can show you the second method. I can just drag it back. If I want to see the data, if I click on this place, if I just click on this place, you see there's a dialog box which opens. I'll just close it and I'll show it again. If I use my mouse and if I keep my cursor here, it says view data. So if I click on this view data, you'll get this data table where the entire records would be displayed. Now suppose in this entire data, you can see how many records are there, 9994. If you want to see only top 10 records, you can just simply select and type here as 10 and you can click on this go button. So the top 10 records are visible right now. So if you want 100 records, you can type 100 or if you want 12 records, you can just simply type as 12 and you can see all the records here, 12 records. So all the 12 records will be visible. Now, why do we need to see this data itself? Sometimes when you have the different sheets, if you want to see the column names or if you want to see the different data which are present here, you can simply scroll, you can simply scroll down and you can see different data which are present. If you like the data and you can just simply drag it and you can drop it at this place. Okay. I'll just drag it and I'll drop it at this place. So this is the data you can see, right? So this is about seeing the entire data, right? Now, suppose if I want to see the same data, which I've, which I've shown there itself. Now, suppose if I want to see a thousand records, if I want to see here only, let's say 10 records or let's say five records, I'll just type here as five, enter. So these are the five records which are visible at my database itself, right? So whatever records you want, you can select. If you select some records which are not inside the sheet, if I select 20,000 records which are not available in the sheet and if I press enter, I'll get those numbers which are the highest records, 994. These are the highest number of records which I have in my Excel file itself. So this is the one way which you can see the data. Next, suppose you have this multiple columns and you do not want to see the entire columns. You want to hide some of the column. Suppose if you want to hide this row ID, you can just simply click on this row column heading. If I click on this drop down, there's an option given as hide. And if you see the row ID column has been hidden here. Again, if I want to hide this order ID, I can just click on this drop down like this and I can click on this hide button. So two columns I have hidden. If I want to see all the columns which are hidden, I can just simply click on show hidden fields. So if you see there are two fields which are visible, which are grayed out. You cannot see it properly. These are grayed out and you can you cannot see it properly here. Same way, if I if I uncheck this, the fields which are only visible are being shown. The hidden fields will not be shown here. Again, I'll click on this show hidden fields. Now, if I want to come back, whichever fields I've hidden, if I want to unhide that, I'll just click on this same place again and I'll select this unhide. I'll click on this drop down again and I'll click on this unhide, right? So I hope you're able to understand how do we hide and unhide different columns, whichever you want. How do we bring the sheets and see the data entirely? If I do not want to see the all records, if I want to see some specific records, I can enter the number here or I can just click on this place and I can enter the number at this place. That's all for this video.